I'm here at Ventano Grill in Henderson, where the manager said the timing could not be worse on this new $2 fee that jo DoorDash is charging in Clark County. He said there were 500 reservations tomorrow for Thanksgiving. They had to cut that number basically in half because of the new 25% capacity requirements. Now he says this $2 fee is adding insult to injury. A $2 Clark County fee imposed by DoorDash is not sitting well with restaurant manager Michael Mongolot. Well, I think it's ridiculous. Um, you know, on top of their, you know, everything else that they charge and the, the amount of money that they're adding on to get the food to a customer, now they want an additional $2. Clark County Commissioner Tick Seegerbloom tweeted his response to the fee, saying DoorDash is misrepresenting the county. The biggest problem right now is it says Clark County fee $2. And so the customer's going to think, oh, that we, the Clark County, um, have, are charging that fee and we're getting that money, and we're not. It's not a Clark County fee, and the money does not go to Clark County. It goes to a multi-billion dollar corporation in San Francisco. DoorDash says the additional fee is in response to an emergency ordinance passed by the county in August, capping delivery service fees to 15%. Seegerbloom says this new $2 charge is a clever workaround. We've been fighting over this issue for several months, and we thought we had everyone agreed to limit their fee to 15 percent um, and looking at it a little closer it looks like they may have the ability to charge separately uh, to the customer alone. In a statement to Fox 5, a DoorDash spokeswoman said in select cities where lawmakers have imposed pricing regulations, DoorDash is considering various measures necessary to offset the unintended consequences of these policies. In some cases, this means charging customers an additional fee when they order from restaurants in their city. DoorDash says it is not misrepresenting the county and the fee is explained when customers click on it. If they want to stick with this, uh, they're going to feel the pain. It's ridiculous. I'd rather not use them as a third party vendor. I'd rather use somebody that doesn't do all those charges like slice and county commissioner seeger bloom says the county is not going to take this lying down